Hello all, this is Halloween, and if you love costumes, cosplay, and Halloween as much as I do, you may want to subscribe because I'm going to be showing you how to make some awesome costumes without breaking the bank and maybe even using some items you already have at home. Today's episode is a great example of what this channel is all about. This is all about throwing together a costume that's easy and simple and comfortable to wear. The kind of costume that when you get invited to a party last minute and you don't know what you should be or could be or you don't know what you can throw together, this is a perfect example of that. It's comfortable, it's recognizable, and you're gonna love it. We will be recreating Baruch Assault from the original 1971 Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory movie. I'm actually already wearing makeup for this look. There is no makeup. She's a little girl. She's probably like 12 years old in the movie, but she's the one that was very adamant about getting her way. And uh, in the end, she was a bad egg, so she fell down the bad egg chute. Let's go ahead and I'm gonna show you how I created this look and we'll take some photos. Here is my bones of my, of my Veruca Salt costume. I have the red dress that I bought on Amazon for very cheap, actually. And then I have some scrap pieces of fabric here. It's actually felt, white felt. I have some buttons. We're gonna need more buttons than this. It's gonna be like 12 or 13 buttons, but I have to go back to the craft store and get that. I have white opaque tights and of course the golden egg. I'm gonna wear this wig and these are actually tap shoes that I bought at Goodwill probably a year ago <laughs> and I'm gonna wear those. I have some craft ribbon, black ribbon, and some white lace that we're going to use to go around the collar and the cuffs of the dress. Let's get started. This is our completed Baruch Assault costume. So easy. I've actually bought this dress. It already had the collar on it. I bought it from Amazon for $31. That's literally all I paid for this whole costume, pretty much. The buttons were about $3. It was a dollar a pack, and I bought three packs of buttons at Hobby Lobby. And I think it was a dollar for the lace trim. I already had the felt. So all I did at the bottom here, or for the waist, is I just wrapped a ribbon around me and tied it. Now if I was going out, I would have sewn this ribbon on at least around the front and tied it in the back. But since I'm not doing anything, <laughs> I just tied it around my body just to save some time. The golden egg can be bought on Amazon for I think $15. You can shop around, I'm sure there's ones that are a little bit cheaper. But this is cute because you can you can actually take 
take it around and use it as your purse. And that way you don't have to carry an additional purse or if you're out with your kids, you can use it to hold extra candy or just whatever. That's that's the costume in its entirety and it was so simple. I hope you love it as much as I do. Let's get dressed and take some photos. Thank you so much for joining me again today. I hope you loved today's episode. Although it was short and sweet, like I said, if you're going to a costume party and you gotta scramble to get something real quick or you wanna be something that's unique and not something that everybody has, if you're, if you're looking for a group or a couple's costume, think of the choices you would have in doing Willy Wonka. One of you could be Veruca Salt, there's the girl that chews gum, there's Augustus Clue, there's Charlie, there's the grandfather, there's Willy Wonka himself, all the little Oompa Loompas. There's just so many different options for like a whole office to do the theme or just a group of friends or a couple even. So it's just a really cool little easy, simple and very comfortable costume anyone can wear and enjoy. Halloween is coming. I've got other costumes coming up that are a little crazier. So uh, I hope you tune in. If you haven't already, please remember to like, subscribe, and share the video. All of you who already have, I appreciate you so much. You've been with me on this journey and you've seen how tough it is to like get yourself out there and, and I know there's a lot of other stuff I can be doing, but understand that I do have a full-time job as well, and I'm kind of just doing this on the side. But I do appreciate all of you. I love all of your comments. If you have any ideas, leave a comment down below. Anything you'd like me to do, you want to see, I'm very interested in that. That does it for today's episode, and I'll see you next time.